armor. Harry trembles like a leaf as Mike Tyndall claimed exposes his darkest secrets on reality TV. Prince Harry is allegedly worried about Mike Tyndall joining I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. According to Closer UK, Prince Harry knows that Tyndall is fiercely loyal to the royal family so he wouldn't cause problems when he appears on the Australian TV show. However, Tyndall's loyalty to the royal family also means that he could target Prince Harry and Meghan Markle because he knows that the couple caused too much drama for the firm in recent years. Harry knows Mike's loyalties are 100% with the royal family and that he's likely seen from the inside the hurt that he and Meghan have caused. While he knows Mike wouldn't intentionally cause drama, he knows Mike can be loose-lipped. He's really hoping he doesn't say anything that puts him or Meghan in a bad light, the source said. During a recent interview, Tyndall revealed that he asked his wife Zara Tyndall permission if could join the reality TV show. But when asked if he also asked permission from the royal family, Tyndall sarcastically said that he doesn't need to tell the public if he did or not. Tyndall was also asked if there were any misconceptions about him that he wanted to change while he was in the jungle. He said that there are none because his life has always been an open book. Tyndall's participation in I'm a Celebrity. Get Me Out of Here marks the first time that a member of the royal family joined a reality TV show. So, it's unclear how things would turn out for Tyndall. However, it's also unlikely for Tyndall to talk about the royal family's issues with Prince Harry and Markle on TV because as a member of the royal family, he isn't allowed to comment on these types of problems. It is also important to note that Prince Harry has a wonderful relationship with his cousin Zara and cousin-in-law, Mike. There is no indication that the Tyndalls were affected by the issues caused by the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. However, there have been reports claiming that Tyndall's mom, Princess Anne was upset with Prince Harry and Markle for quitting their royal duties two years ago. And during an interview, Princess Anne seemingly threw shade at the Sussexes by saying that royals need to suck it up sometimes. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's lives have been rather uneventful since they decided to step back from their royal duties back in 2020. And whilst there have been a number of veiled jabs at the royal family ever since their exit, one royal historian has claimed that one moment in particular caused the late queen to hit back at the couple. According to the Mirror, in Robert Lacey's book Battle of Brothers, the author wrote that the decision made by the Sussexes to commercialize under their own royal trademark prompted the queen to put a stop to it as the couple were acting without her permission. Lacey claims Meghan and Harry's decision to sell merchandise under their own royal trademark Sussex Royal without the Queen's go-ahead was a step too far and caused the family to finally hit back. However, members of the royal family and the firm in particular producing their own goods isn't a new concept. King Charles sells various organic products in his Duchy Originals range and royal residences across the country sell souvenirs that visitors can purchase. Despite this, the issue with Harry and Meghan surfaced when they failed to get consent from Harry's late grandmother before they announced their plan. It is said that the pair have spent thousands of pounds trademarking a number of products which ranged from t-shirts to bandanas. Lacey wrote, once again Harry had totally failed to consult the Queen about a major initiative affecting his royal work and image, and the image of the crown as a whole. The family finally hit back. Elizabeth II had always had a soft spot for Harry, and she had been delighted by the arrival of Meghan, whose personal energies seemed to complement her grandson so well.